YouTube, YouTube, what happened to Gabby? This is the number one story all over the globe. Uh, Gabrielle Petito, 22, vanishes on a trip, cross-country trip with her boyfriend. Boyfriend returns without Gabby in Gabby's van and claims to know nothing. Or doesn't even give any information. The boyfriend doesn't even give any information. He disappeared as soon as he got back. His parents claim not to know where he's at. Sounds like a cover-up. FBI have raided this man's house to find nothing. But guess who's on the hunt right now? You guessed it. Dog the Bounty Hunter. Breaking news. Breaking news. They say that Dog the Bounty Hunter confirms that Brian Laundry, who is Gabby's boyfriend or ex-fiance, is alive. Dog said he feels that he's going to be capturing him within the next hour or so. So we all have to stay tuned. Breaking news. If you believe dog's bullshit. Ask all the parents out there, like, with that scenario, you know. you ha I don't know if you guys seen this, but there is a videotape of um, a police interaction with Gabby and Brian, her ex-fiance, where they had gotten to an altercation, a physical altercation, where I believe, like, he smacked her around, she pushed him around. They got into an altercation, and the police let them go. The family been all over Dr. Phil... It's all over the news. It's all over YouTube. It's all over any social media you could think of. What happened to Gabby? So I want to ask the parents this. Um, if you had a child that you let go on a cross-country trip with her fiance, and he came back in her car without your daughter, without any story of what happened, how would you feel? What would you do? What would be your next step? Everybody on YouTube, you guys stay tuned to the Rob and the Culture show, man. Make sure you hit the bell, subscribe, come be part of the culture, because if you're not in the culture, where you at?